In the mood for a less traveled Tannenbaum? Sounds good to me. Soon our Christmas trees might be homegrown on the Big Island. There's a project underway to establish a Christmas tree farm there. And KITV4's Jill Kuramoto shows us what's sprouting up on the slopes of Mauna Kea. It's a business that's truly starting from the ground up. So when we sow these seedlings, we'll put two to three seeds per tube. The Douglas and Noble fir seedlings being carefully nurtured here at the state nursery in Kamuela in five to six years should be ready for your living room. Hopefully by, by growing the trees here, we won't have to bring them in. And that would mean no more free rides for unwanted pests like wasps, slugs and frogs. The project, funded by a Department of Ag grant, has allowed the Hawaii Agriculture Research Center to buy the seeds for 1,600 trees, seeds that are sure to be disease-free. And these were sown about January of last year, so this is almost a year old. And this is about the size that we want to have them be when we put them out to plant. When they're ready, the seedlings are transported to a two-acre lot in Humaula, elevation 6,500 feet, where conditions are similar to what these firs are used to. They're protected from cattle, pigs, and birds, but not VOG. Apparently, Douglas firs don't like VOG. But the trees planted in 2002 are surviving and growing, giving researchers hope. So we know it can grow, but it's still a challenge to find which is the correct seed source because you have to have a seed source that's adapted or will do well in your site. If the project succeeds, it would branch off in two ways. Farming jobs for beneficiaries of the Department of Hawaiian Homelands whose land is being used for planting and true grown in Hawaii Christmas trees at lower prices. Jill Kuramoto, KITV4 News.